Yeah. So you refuse to give up? Right. But I haven't seen you for weeks. Ben, you've got to make a choice. I'll call you later. Goodbye. What the hell is this? Trying to play smart, huh? Now I've got you. East. Central? Justice for all. Justice for all. The court. The council. Chan. It's good to see you. I've been waiting for you. What kept you? <clears throat> Do you have any idea why I wanted to see you? No, why? I'm in a good mood. <laughs> I'm interested to know why you didn't ask him why he disappeared so suddenly. Weren't you curious? Not really. I guess it's just like everybody said. He was seriously injured. He needed to hide up. Or maybe he was just tired of business. <laughs> Who can tell? So many stories. Which one is true? Yeah, but all these stories are just rumors, let's face it. <laughs> Surely you can make an intelligent guess. A guess? I don't know. A holiday. Even old people need holidays, don't you know that? Really? Yeah. Oh. Huh? Hold on. It's for you, some chick. Thank you. Hi. I said I'd call you later. I can't talk right now. I'll call you when I can, okay? Goodbye now. Argument with your girlfriend? Such a pity. She sounded really nice. You know, sort of young and innocent, if you know what I mean, huh? It was just a line. You know, there's one thing that I really hate, and that's mobile phones. They really get on my nerves. Pain in the ass. I got a pager. That way I can simply call a person back whenever I like. I hate being followed Tell around me. by... The old man? He is talkative as you? <laughs> You'll soon find out. Huh. By the way, I haven't introduced myself. Most people just call me Uncle Y. I've been working for the old man for years. Remember, I'm only looking for him. Nobody else. Is it still much further? Patience, okay? We're nearly there. You know the rule. You have to face the outcome yourself. I know. I'm well prepared. Tell me, what do you want with the old man? I'll tell him myself. Better be something worthy of him, you understand? He doesn't want to hear about mundane things anybody can handle. He just gets pissed off at you wasting his time. And when the old man gets pissed off, that ain't nice to see. But he's in a bad mood and everybody gets shit. That's me included, so don't piss him off, okay? Tell me, is there anything this guy can't do? Well, let me think a moment. Yeah, I guess the old man can't fly, that's about all. I don't think so. <laughs> well, mister, here we are. Is that him? Just taking a little nap. Recharging his batteries. When you get to his age, you need time in the day to rest and recuperate. You know what I mean? What about my job? Now, nah, young man, don't be impatient. Call me Ben. 
<laughs> Call me Uncle Y. Sit down. Relax. So he's the man from the legend. What's the problem? He's older than I thought. <laughs> well, no matter how great you are, you can't help getting old and sick. That's life, so don't forget that, huh? That depends. What's that supposed to mean? A man is a man. We're all gonna get old sometime, ain't that right? Don't you agree with me? Not everybody will get old. If you've got a strong enough will, you'll win. It's not a matter of winning or losing in life, you know. I tell you, it's not like gambling in some casino. I believe you can win anything in life. And lose, too. Believe me. If you're talking now about being immortal, it doesn't matter whether you win or lose. If you've got money, you might as well keep it. You're too old. You wouldn't understand. <laughs> And maybe you're just too young to share my point of view. But I'll tell you, if you're rich, it still doesn't mean you have to bet all your money in one go, huh? What? Lost something, have you? I bet it's that mobile phone. You see, that's another reason why I don't want to have one of those things. You want to go back there and look for it? No. I'm not expecting any calls. It doesn't matter. Uh, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. Don't you forget, Ben, you're still a young man. And when you get to his age over there, you'll see that winning isn't always so important. Sometimes when you do win, you find that the cost of winning isn't always worth it. But he's old. old. <laughs> what? He may be old, but if he kicked you, you'd have swallowed that cigarette hole in your face. It'd have been such a mess that even your mother would have had difficulty recognizing you. I used to be arrogant when I first met him, just like you. Oh, merciful goddess, we ask for your assistance. Please let us escape the ravages of war and let the bandits only attack other villages. In return, we shall offer you great sacrifices. Oh, where was I? Oh, yes. Merciful Goddess, please bless us with a peaceful life. Let us all live in harmony and happiness. Most important, may all our boys be healthy, and may they all grow up to be all by them responsible citizens, and bring credit to our village. May all the families have bad luck. No, 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 sorry, I mean best luck. And may all our harvests be bountiful. Please help Chun remember an eye for an eye. When he's beaten, let him stab the other twice in the night. May I also be blessed with a baby when I'm 80. Please let Y go bald very soon, so that his fleas stop infesting the village. And stop Hippo from stealing food. Or at least if he steals, please stop him from being caught red-handed. And please let Big Mouth stop talking of all the women all the time. And let him stop running after all the bitches when they're in heat. If he wants to disgrace himself, let him go to the next village instead. And help Little Bun grow up and stop fooling around with all the boys. Nice kick right in the nuts. Hey, four against one, that's not fair. It's a good thing there's only one of him or you'll be in trouble. <laughs> anyway, may the merciful goddess bless you all. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> What's it got to do with you? Let him go! Yeah, we're neighbors! Leave him alone! Quit threatening him like that! Yeah, where'd you get that weapon, huh? Who cares? Hippo, you stole my rice last time! It was me, it was Chun here! What do you mean? You ate with Hoyt, didn't you? Hey, we agreed we wouldn't say anything about it! Why are you always dropping us in the shit, you bastard? I bet it was you who stole a sacrificial pig's head! It was you who stole a pig's head, didn't you? You idiot! It wasn't your pig's head, but it was my rice! You goddamn bastard! Yeah, so what? So give it back! And also, give me six chickens! All of you! Six chickens, who do you think you are? Yeah, right! You're crazy, I don't have six chickens! But anyway! <laughs> hey, who's this guy? Do you think you could be a 
deserter? I don't think he could be a deserter. He's much too clean shaven. Yeah. Got a big knife. Yeah, it must be for choppy wood. What's in that bag? I wonder what he could be carrying in that bag. I don't like him. He looks like a bandit to me. How many bandits have you seen? Hey, what do you think? Have you seen any bandits? Of course I have, you idiot. I've seen dozens of them. What do you want here? Boy. Where's the Seven Saints Temple? We got dozens of temples around here. But you'll need to pay money first. Leave the village, take the beach road. Thanks. Hey, did he give him some money? What's happening? What's going on? What if he comes here? He doesn't speak to anybody, does he? Where's he going? Yeah. Keep away from him, kid. Hey, come on, let's follow him. Yeah, see where he's going. Come on. Hey, why? Why did he give you that money? Yeah, right. Yeah, why? How much did he give you? Yeah. Well, he wanted direction, so I made him pay. Well, what about that, huh? He's trying to the Seven Saints Temple. Oh, I'm gonna follow him there. If I can get some more money, you get your share. Yeah, right. Come on. Dress him up. Make him look respectable. Come on. There you go. All right. Nice day, huh? The time of year. Hmm? I thought you might need a guide. That's why I came along. Can't be too sure around these parts, you know. Shall we go? Don't worry. Nobody knows this route except me. There's no danger. What's the matter? Are you scared? There's nothing to it. Don't worry. Just do what I do, right? Hey! Yep! Woohoo! Yeah! -ha! <laughs> this is your lucky day. Found a guide who shortened your journey. Show you the beautiful countryside too. Yeah! <laughs> Watch your step there. Hold on tight now. You don't want to slip. Be careful here. It's really slippery. All right. This is the quickest way, I promise you, mister. But at least you're seeing some of the most scenic beauty spots as well. It's not much further. Hope you're not too tired. All right. If you want to rest, you just let me know, okay? I don't blame you. Bandits. Oh, don't worry. They're a small fry. We've been looking for you, you bastard. Where's our rice, huh? What's up? I don't get it. Don't give us that shit. Are you gonna give it back? What? You threatening me? Get him! <laughs> <laughs> I was like a man possessed. The blows 
were raining down left, right, and center. I swung around my left and followed up with a straight right cap. Ow! They were no match. What's up? Nothing. It sounds exciting. I didn't know the hero was supposed to be you, though. What's the point of all this story, anyway, huh? Okay. I'm here to see the old man. Before you see the old man, you must know the story of who he is. Huh? Shh. Listen. Thanks for saving my life. Why did they want to kill you? They're from the neighboring village. They're always causing trouble. Whenever I come across them, well, there's a fight. They hate me, you know. Well, oh, that's the temple you wanted, huh? The Seven Saints Temple. Not much to look at now. It's all in ruins. It was built when my great-grandfather was still the general. So, this is it, huh? This is all that's left. This is it. Not much of it left. There was a statue, covered in gold leaf, but it all got looted. It used to be the most beautiful temple in the area. Hundreds of people would come here to worship every day in the days with my great-grandfather, General Lee. No, wait a minute, he was the eunuch. 
Well, whoever it was, I can't remember. But anyway, it was really popular. Yeah, those were the days. Why'd you come to the temple anyway? It's hot today. Too damn hot. Why the hell can't it rain? Huh? Hey, kid, wait a minute! Hey! Hey, wait, wait! Hey, get back! Go from here! Oh, oh. <laughs> Only wanted some water. Take a drink. Hey, mister, have some water. Look, if there's anything I can do for you, let me know. I owe you my life. All right. Hey, what's your name? I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? I've forgotten. What? You've forgotten? Don't tell me you got amnesia. I had a friend who got it real bad. Poor guy. Can you remember how you lost your memory? I was a soldier. That's all I know. Damn Japs, I knew it! I was nearly killed by one of their bullets. They missed me, got my parents. I'm an orphan. The villagers just took care of me. I guess I was lucky. Of course, <laughs> they made me work for my keep. I wouldn't say it was an easy childhood. Now I've finally grown up. Japanese bastards. Look here, mister. You've forgotten, but I haven't. I just remembered we haven't eaten. I'm looking for a woman. Oh yeah? What's her name? I guess you don't remember, right? That makes it tricky. Know what she looks like? She's... beautiful. Mosquitoes must be reincarnated Jap soldiers! <sighs> right. That's it. How can there be so many mosquitoes under one roof? This place must be jinxed! This place is a dump. I can't even go back to the village! Tell me someone, I'm surrounded by hostile gangs and homicidal mosquitoes!
You were very lucky I didn't kill you. Don't ever creep up on me. You understand? I didn't mean to scare you. I, I'm really sorry, mister. Really, I didn't. I guess you thought it was the bandits, huh? They weren't bandits. I'm quite sure of it. I thought it was strange, so many of them there at one time. Hey, you know what? I'd say they were really after you, mister. The way you use your sword, though, nobody would have a chance against you. Huh. Yeah, tell you what, mister. Why don't you teach me martial arts? Then I can help you if you need me. Like what, huh? Well, I prefer the sword. You see, I think the sword would be best suited to my fighting temperament. You know what I mean? Nice and direct. Nothing too fancy or complicated. What do you think, huh? Have you used a sword before? Oh yeah, sure I have lots of times. Chopping up wood and stuff, oh, and slicing things. I'm pretty good at that, you see. <laughs> the sword is also used for killing. All I want to learn is a simple but powerful sword stance, all right? Well, don't just sit there looking at me like that. What do you think? Is it possible? <laughs> it's possible, but simple and powerful. Hey, I'm sure there's some powerful ones that are easy to learn, aren't there? Have you heard of the three open, three secret, and three reverse stances? Each of these is divided into three stages of three parts. Each part is divided into... No, 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 no. It's too complicated. Isn't there something divided into one part, one part, one part? That's simple, huh? Yeah, that's simple. Thick and Dora. <coughs> You're holding it all wrong. He'll never do it like that. I was just warming up. You're just doing it with your arm. You gotta put your heart into it. I did, right? I just need to practice some more. If you don't want to teach me, then just forget it. Don't give me all that Zen crap. That's the point. What's that mean? It won't work, if your mind's not tuned in. I don't want to learn to chop up wood. I want to learn martial arts. The theory's the same. What are you talking about? It can be. Yes, it is. There's the sword for chopping wood. And the sword for killing. They're both the same. There's no difference. Same stance. It's only the man. That's the difference. Not the weapon. So what you're trying to tell me is, it doesn't matter what weapon you use, you can even chop wood with your bare hands. Chop, 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 chop. If you like. Something like that. Hey, look, mister. Just give me some of your inner strength and I'll get out of here, all right? The power of illusion. Where does it all end? The power of illusion. Yeah, well, I don't buy that crap. It's out of date nowadays. Nowadays, you gotta be first with a weapon. Draw it first, fire it first, aim to kill, that's all. It's the only way to survive. If you don't draw first, if you're too slow, then it's just too bad. You had your one chance. You don't get a second. An interesting theory, young man. But it's not that simple. Believe me, I know it. Many people think life is simply black and white. 
They refuse to see reality. They do not want to complicate their lives with its many shades of gray. They do not realize that winning or losing does not just depend on whether you have gained or lost something. building a second airport. I remember when I first came here, I had nothing. Everybody lived happily. Now there are new airports, new roads, and new bridges. The people are rich, but they will never be happy. New becomes old and is replaced. Because otherwise, there's no progress. That's very true. All new things will become old. How can I help you, Ben? Tell me. Kill somebody. And when this person is killed, will you then have what you wanted? Yes. Tell me, how do you want this person killed? You want it done my way? If you want it done my way, then I'll tell you a little story first. Although it doesn't concern you, you should pay attention. I think listening to my story will help you solve your problem. Listen to what I'm telling you. That man is a killer. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, yeah, we have never in any way. I've seen what he can do with a sword. Just take my word for it. Now this sword, it's his invincible sword. I managed to steal it from him. And why won't you believe me, huh? Oh, Understand this man is invincible. Look, there's no way you can defeat this man. Believe me.
Hey, that was some chain reaction. Hey, kid! Hey, kid! Hey, kid, please open the door! Open up, we need your help! Open the door! He doesn't remember anything. Some bandits turned up, and he killed them all. It was amazing. Hey, he's waking up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, right. Right. Up. There he is. Hey, Mister, yep. it's all right. The yeah. bandits are all dead yeah. now. You yeah. killed a lot of them. Well done. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, <laughs> Mister, you killed yeah, all of them. Got them. Yeah. <laughs> you asshole. How do you know? You weren't even there. There, look at him. Yeah, well, I heard about it, didn't I? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 the bandits. Told you this guy's Now maybe you'll believe what I say in future. Man, him. Man, you away. That's right. Manhan, it's why ye. Whatever happens now, I'll be with you. I'll look after you, Manhan. Where's Manhan? Oh, he went that way. Where's Manhan? I saw him down there. That way. Yeah, he's down the end of the village. Yeah, straight down there. Oh. 
Looking for man here? Hey, wait! The sky's beautiful. But I think it's gonna rain. Well then, after the rain's gone, the sky will be even more beautiful, won't it? Oh, I'm bored. Bother... No. <laughs> so how are your wounds? Are they better now? Hmm. If you're in pain, you know, you should... Ah, oh, it's okay. Honest. <laughs> Just hungry. Ah, oh, I'll make some noodles. Wait. Thank you for taking care of me. I'm very grateful. Mm. Do I look different? You're a bit darker and thinner. <laughs> Why was I whiter and fatter? <laughs> Not really. You haven't changed much. How was I before? What about me? Have I changed at all? Sure. You've changed. A lot. In what way? You're much prettier. <laughs> so you do remember me? Remember? <laughs> yeah, I think I do. I remember waiting for you. Uh, I'll go make some noodles. I'll see you back there. Wait. I hope to remember who I was after seeing you. You can't understand. Every night I have nightmares. It's terrible. I can't remember. Please, Yi. Help me remember. Hey! Hey! Hey, Brother Fong! Hey, you should come and eat. You've talked long enough. Thanks for bringing me here. Forget it. You saved my life once. It's the least I could do in return. Hey, sis. You coming? I've prepared lunch. Yeah, let's go. Hey. Hey, come on, brother. Hey, come and eat. All right, everybody, let's have a toast to the reunion of Mr. and Mrs. Fung. Cheers! Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, why? I never thought he'd come back. You're lucky. Yeah, and we love each other very much. I'm so happy now. I always remember, many years ago, when I was so poor, his family treated me so kindly. His grandmother always used to make clothes for us both. 
We were always dressed the same. We were a couple even then. Then when his grandmother died, Manheim started making the clothes instead, and he helped me with the vegetables. When my father died, he started helping me with the farm. My mother loved him. He was her son-in-law. I hear you're a soldier, brother. Yeah, brother, do you get paid in the army? Of course he get paid, you stupid idiot. They say in the army you do a lot of cleaning and also the cooking. Yeah, but Eddie, they also do a lot of killing. Huh? Of they do. But then they only have to kill bad guys. Ain't that right, huh? I bet Brother Fung killed a lot of Japanese. It's a good thing you were living in the war zone. The Japs would have been sure to rape you. <laughs> <laughs> to bring that up! Don't you realize it's painful for him? Don't you think you could learn something from Brother Fong? In my opinion, he's a hero. I waited. And now he's returned. I'm a lucky woman. Yeah, but the problem is he can't remember the slightest thing about him or his past. Ah. Get off me! Well, never mind that. Just eat up. Come on, this is a party, isn't it? Were we a couple? You remember that night? You know what? You're the only man I ever... Why? Why? Come back. Come back here, why? 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 Please come back. Why? Why? Are you all right? I can't remember. I can't remember anything. I even have nightmares about it. 
I thought when I saw you that it would all come back to me, but it hasn't. I'm sorry. You know, some nights I bang my head against the wall and I don't even remember why I'm doing it. You don't know. You just don't know how painful it is. Oh. So selfish. You always think about yourself. Where have you been? Seven years. Not even one word from you. You have any idea what I've been through, man? You don't know what it was like. Oh, you, you don't understand. You don't understand. If I don't come back, what are you going to do? I'll just have to go to him. But you never left. came here to watch the sunrise when we were kids. You were always fascinated by it. One day you said, I'll go east one day. What did you say? I said I'd follow you anywhere. Why, Yi, what about just staying here and living in peace in the village? I'll follow you anywhere. Ben Han, you know I've learned to make clothes myself now. Now, the sword is one with the heart. Ah, easy, easy. That's pretty good. Yeah, that was mm. real. Have you guys been messing around with the wood, huh? I want Brother Fung to teach me. Hey, don't worry. You don't need it. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I bet she's falling for Brother Fang. He better watch out. Yeah, right. <laughs> ah! oh! 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 Hey, bandits! Huh? Yeah! 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 Yeah!
I'm looking for Fun Man Hin. Now where is he? If you tell me, then I promise to spare you all. But if you don't tell me... Don't tell me you all want to die, do you? No, no, please, we don't want to die. No, please don't kill us. Please don't kill us. Please don't kill us. Please don't kill us. Please don't kill us.
man here. You escaped last time. But this time, you won't be so lucky. You're dead meat, Kong.
So we meet again. What's the matter? You surprised to see me? Oh, yeah. Remember what day it is today? You don't. The day my brother died. We were the seven wolves. We swore to live and die together. But he killed my brother because of his principles. It can't be true. You're lying. I'm not lying. Your beloved hero here was nothing but a common bandit, just like the rest of us! Do you know how many people he's killed? I won't believe you. Then him, tell me it is true. If it wasn't for his goddamn principles, we'd be rich by now. My brother loved him, but he betrayed us all. He killed my big brother. Now he'll pay. He'll pretend to be righteous, but he turned on his benefactors. Did you really think I would let you get away with it? Well, now I'm the leader. I got a score to settle. You say you don't remember anything? When I'm finished with you, you won't forget it. I'm gonna show the world what a coward you are! Manhan, whatever happens to you, I'll follow you anywhere. I'll never leave your side. <gasps> yeah!
So, have you found the answer yet? Well, I think I'm different. I don't think so. You scared? Yeah. I'm scared you'll pay more than you can afford. I want it done. I'll pay anything for that. You really want him dead? Yes. Hi, Ben. This is Y here. Take this gun, Ben. If you think you'll be number one after killing me, then you go ahead. An egomaniac? Number one or number two, I don't care. It's all the same. I killed so many men. My woman died because of me. I just don't care anymore. You think I won't kill you because of her? I don't care. As long as I kill you. I'm better than you in some ways. But in others, you have the advantage over me. You have a woman who will sacrifice herself for the man she loves. You should treasure that. I'd do anything, Ben. Just to be with you. Be quiet! Please don't do it. Be quiet! I'm not giving up now! Then kill me, Ben. This isn't fun anymore. 